Hi guys, so today is going to be a really funny and interesting video and it is going to be a tag that I'm, uh, I sort of created and I'm going to call it the remake tag. Um, so basically this idea is that you take an old charm that you made um, for me ages ago or, or if you just want to do something that you made quite recently and really sit down and try and improve it. So this is just going to be me showing you some of my old charms um, compared to my new charms as you can see here and it's going to be quite funny as my old charms kind of sucked. So I tag everyone whoever wants to try this um, please do. So let's get on with the video. So first I'm going to start off with what I think is the funniest comparison um, and it is this sushi charm. Um, quite a few people have made this but I think the comparison is absolutely hilarious. So as you can see this was my first attempt and this is my you know later attempt and as you can see there is a massive difference so let me just show you this one because it's absolutely hilarious so this is the first charm well first attempt of this charm that I did and as you can see the face is awful it looks drunk like someone drew it on with a crayon and um, the detail isn't actually that bad but like if you look at the back look how dirty that is oh it's so disgusting it makes me like cringe and there's colors on it and it's just absolutely awful. Like I said, the, the, the detail's not too bad, apart from the miscolor, the discoloration, but yeah. And then compared to the newer charm, again, the detail's really, like, not that different, but um, it's just so funny to me. So the face is obviously much smaller, much better, the whole charm is much de better, much cleaner. Still not completely clean, because there's still have problems with that. But yeah, and I did, like, more of a translucent green here, and... Yeah, the face is different, the face is smaller, um, I'm using gold eye pins a lot nowadays as well. It's just, like, there's no there's no reason for me to just explain why the one on the left is better than the one on the right. So yeah, that's the first one, which I think is absolutely hilarious. Next is another funny one, and it is my rock charms. So, here are the rock charms. And as you can see, the one on the left is my first attempt, and the one on the right is my newest attempt um, and like I said there's really no reason for me to actually have to explain why one's better but so this one looks like this and I painted the faces on this is one of my like really really old charm and I used to paint on the faces so the face is drunk again and god knows what this is like I just I don't know what kind of shape I made this into but there's like cracks and lines it's just really bad and then this is the newer one which I sell these on my Etsy by the way and it's smaller the cuter shape, the face is tiny and made out of clay, it's just so much a better made, um, more care taken, more skill involved, so yeah, there's those two as well. Next is my Pikachu charm, and I recently did a tutorial on this charm, so go check it out. So this is my, mm, wow, awful, awful first attempt, and this is my newer charm, I actually did a tutorial on this one. So these are my two new charms, this is the newest one and this is my old one and as you can see the old one is fat, chubby, the face is massive and half made out of clay, half made out of paint. Um, the tail is absolutely massive, it's just bulky and I can't, don't know if you could be able to see, um, but it's just covered in dirt and dust and the glaze is all sticky and the paint's come off and I took the eye pin out but... Um, it's just awful and it's covered in dust um, and compared to these ones, these ones are much cleaner, it's a nicer design, it's just paint, there's no extra clay apart from the base, it's just, they're just so much better and, and the glaze isn't sticky, the design is neater and it just doesn't look like it's been on steroids, so there's those ones. Next I'm going to show you the difference between my cupcakes, now this is always absolutely hilarious. So first is, I'll show you literally the first ever cupcake charms that I ever made, which is this. As you can see, this is absolutely awful, so the base is like, just, I don't even know, it's barely even on the top. The, the texturing is absolutely awful, god knows why I thought that looked like a cupcake, there's clay on it. The... Icing looks really unrealistic, so does the strawberry. To be fair, I actually still like this cute little beading, like, here. I think it's actually still really pretty, but it's just so awful. So here is a cupcake that I made more recently, and the icing is much more realistic. So it's this one. So obviously it's got a face as well, but if you ignore that, like, it's much more realistic. The icing is much, much better done, because I used an icing tip. Um, so yeah, and the the, I think the colour is much more realistic for a cupcake um, and I'm using gold eye pins as well so there's those two. And then next I will show you some of my first ever cupcake charms with faces and these are absolutely hilarious. So here is, I think this is literally one of the, yeah this is literally one of the first ones I ever made. 
um, it looks like this and it just it looks fat it looks like it's got like a double chin it's I don't know what happened to the sides there's dirt on it the icing is made out of scribbles and it's awful and like you can mark it the face is just well okay the face isn't too bad but it's just like the double chin just makes me laugh like it's I don't know what happened to the shape of it when I was baking it but there's one and then here's another one and the face is just really gawky um the cupcake is like it's not even misshapen it's just the weird shape like I don't really know what happened the texturing on this isn't too bad but it's not very even around the sides and the base is really 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 messy but yeah so this one's not too bad it could be worse and then this is like one of my original cupcake designs that I used to stick with forever so it had rhinestones and canes and to be fair these sold really well on my Etsy but it's just it, like awful the the base has got marks all over it it's dirty the face is really it's creepy looking and the color of the cupcake just isn't the right color I don't like it so here are some of my older ones and then compare it to my new ones it looks like this so as you can tell I've just got so much better the face is much more intricate and smaller um, the icing obviously this one scribbles but the icing in general was just been better made um, the color is cuter this one actually makes a um, a dough colour with translucent so it looks a bit nicer but even so usually my cupcakes are so much better it's less dirty she says showing the bottom it's got dirt on it well it's not so much less dirty I just know how to clean my charms this like this time around but yeah so these are this, uh, this is one of my favourite cupcakes I've ever made so yeah again compared to my other cupcakes they are <laughs> much 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 better so that's those ones and then last but not least I'm going to show you my first ever micro marble cupcake which is just so awful um, so it looks like this again the colour of the cupcake I just don't like the colour um, it's really odd shape um, it's dirty messy and the micro marbles bled everywhere um, it just looks really awful and the face has gone really funky and then compared to what I make nowadays this isn't one of my usual micro marble cupcakes but um I thought I'd just show this one because I think it's like the cutest one so here's like a more intricate design the sprinkles um, it's smaller the color is better as well um, I'm using gold eye pins it's just again there's no need for me to say why one's better than the other it's pretty clear you can tell which one's better um, yeah so those are the last charms I'm going to show you so thank you so much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed this, I think it's absolutely hilarious to see how bad some of my charms were. Um, if you want to see my first ever ever charms when I was like 9, I will leave a link to a video if it's still up on my channel on the screen now and it is just hilarious so I recommend you going and watching that. Um, yeah, so I hope you try this tag out, this was really to get people to pick old charms that they made and see if they can do better or remake them and it's actually really nice to see that you can improve because it's not very easy to see it if you'll just keep making and making but you need something to compare it to so I'd love to see them send them to me on Twitter Instagram well Twitter or Facebook or YouTube and then I'd love to see some Instagram photos I'm um, using my hashtag xxrufus so yeah I tag every one of my subscribers to try out this video um, I really hope you enjoyed this video so bye